good morning my beautiful people <laughs> good morning y'all y'all already know what time it is it's time for the gym i'm just getting out of work <sighs> 12 hour shift but i have to make it happen move up since they are ready 12 hour shift and i have about 12 that i've done 12 hour shift and i have to come up I will be doing another cleanse tomorrow. So, I think I'm going to vlog and show y'all that tomorrow. So, thank you for me. So, for tomorrow, what today is the 12th. That video will be on the 11th. I think I'm right. Hold on. Yeah, today is 12th, Dave. Mm -hmm. Today is 12th, and I said 11th, girl. Today is the 12th. That day will be the 13th. Yeah. So, we'll go back to work on the 14th. So, yeah, y'all see, I got all the energy in the world. I have no energy, but I'm about to go up here and get it done. I thought I was going to do leg day today, even though you know I'm still going to do something with legs. But I think I'm going to say leg day for tomorrow. I'm going to go in. If I haven't been here in two days, I'm going to go in and do Cardio, squats, maybe some hip adductors. I don't know. I don't really know. I don't have a plan for what I'm gonna do. When I go in, I know I'm just gonna wing it, and I know I'm gonna get on that massage.
such as your bleed because I'm feeling some type of way and I want to record this fresh if I want to put it on the video because I'm being very transparent and I'm thinking about the video to go into depth with how I'm feeling so I'm going to do that today but um it will be no workout no none of that but it will be no be a video where I go in more detail but I'm just putting it to y'all right now. So I saw something that didn't sit well with me. And I'm always the type of person even at the age that I am now. I give people too many second chances, too many chances to show me that I'm just not nothing to them. Like I don't know, it might just be me feeling the way I feel and I'm bad at communicating. But with some people because some people think I'm just oversensitive and they try to Say I'm being sensitive and over and I overreact when I try to um explain my feelings to them. So though I think those types of people I just need to get out of my life, especially when we are really doing what I'm doing right now. I need to get that out of my life. But um I feel like all my life I have been I have felt disposable to people and um like they can, I'm just easily replaced and I know I'm a good person I know that I know that I'm kind of I know I'm difficult but I know also know that I'm a good person a lot comes with me even through my difficulties and whatever I am a good person and I give my last I give the shirt off my back I like I know I'm a good person so when I see stuff and when I see people and when people treat me like I'm disposable, I get upset and I um, speak on it because I don't treat people like they're disposable. I honestly value people. Like I value people's friendships. I value my husband. I value my children. I value my mother. I value everybody. My friends. I value everybody. And if I ever called you a friend with the things that I went through when I was younger, as a day, if I ever called you a friend, I truly meant it. But I have yet to come across somebody who truly meant like that for me. Like I have there, like I, I even recently I had to stop being friends with my best friend that I have been friends with since I was little because she treated me like I was disposable, and I hate, I hate, I hate to feel like I'm disposable, and I give people chances after chances after chances if I. I, I I, I do it to myself because how I am as a person, I'm going to be there. And if you're just not there for me like I'm there for you, it gets to me. And I hold stuff in. And this is my toxic. This is toxic. This is my toxic trait. I hold stuff in and I never say nothing about it. But then when I do communicate about it, that's why I say I'm over. I'm dramatic about it because I actually, I, I flash it. I go off. Because I hold it in. I see a lot of stuff and I hold it in. But when I finally do speak on it, I get mad. And that's something that I'm working on. I get mad and I just... Mm. Because I'm really a good person. And everybody that has been friends with me know that I'm a good person. But now it's down to the point where it's just about to be me and my husband and my children. Because... I can't do it anymore with me coming off my depression and trying to get my life together in 2020. I just can't do with the toxic stuff. And it's like they know it and they just they just do it anyway. And if you feel a certain way with me with something that I did, talk to me about it. We can figure something out and if it's if it's not gonna change anything, we can go our separate ways. But don't just treat me like I'm disposable. I'm not disposable. I I leave them mark on everybody that I meet because the type of person that I am but yet you treat me like I'm disposable and a lot of people in today and age they don't value people they don't value friendships they don't value um like memories and stuff they don't value it so you some people you are really disposable too and I have to get that you know I have to understand that a lot of people are not gonna be like me a lot of people don't value people so, I just got, I have to get that together. Like, I have to understand, like, not understand it, but, like, I have to, I'm sensitive. I'm real sensitive. I'm kind of sensitive. Some stuff I'm not sensitive about, and some stuff I really am, especially if I wouldn't do it to you. So, when it's the 
done to me, I have to get myself together. Like I started in the middle of my workout and I couldn't I shake the feeling. I couldn't I couldn't continue my workout. Even like sometimes I can just work that frustration out. But when I saw it, it was somebody that I really valued and they don't value me. So now I, I I've been seeing it for the past years and I should have been ended it. And I've been taking steps this year. Like I don't reach out to them no more. I don't but when I like I don't reach out, I don't initiate anything. I don't do none of that. So and we don't have conversations, like they don't reach out to me. So I just gotta it hurts at first. Like I, I tell people friendship and everything, like everything that you do, you have a relationship with that person and if you really like I don't know I guess in different seasons people some people are still seasonal some people are um, lifetime and the only person that I have met in my life that have been lifetime to me my children and my husband and you know some of my family but other than that I have not met a lifetime friendship I like like people that's gonna be there for life like I don't have that I don't I don't have that. Even with like my cousins and stuff, I ain't got with now. They're not their lifetime because they make me feel disposable. A lot of people make me feel disposable, and if you make me feel disposable, I withdraw myself. I withdraw myself a lot, and I'm about to start doing that. And by the time they notice it, I'm not gonna care. Anymore. I've been rambling on for seven minutes. I think I'm gonna put this in the video and I'm gonna explain it in more depth. But like, I wanted to do it while I was feeling how I was feeling. Like, I'm feeling better now that I talked about it. And even though I don't have that many subscribers, at least the people that I do have with, at least watch it or eventually watch it. But yeah, I wanted to talk about it while it was I was in my pure form, like while. I, felt how I felt. Now when I do the video I may do I just might be a double upload day. I might do um, another video later on today speaking on it more and depending on how I feel most likely I am. So I think I don't know. I just <clears throat> I um and then I'ma look at this before Put it, I, might, I might put it on the video and I might don't and I might keep it for another day so I don't know but hopefully y'all like this video hopefully y'all subscribe to my channel and continue to watch me turn this fat into fat you can tell like I can't even be my <laughs> I can't be myself right now well I'm myself but like I'm I'm just over a lot of stuff first. So like this video, subscribe to my channel, continue to watch me turn this.